Hello, I'm Artifacts of Mars. This is kind of a local issue, but it's got under my skin, so we're going to discuss it. A local high school, uh, Hilton High School, I'm not quite sure where Hilton is. I'd have to look it up on the map, but it's not far from where I live. Look at the sign here. Hilton High School, home of the cadets. Can you believe this? And they won't let some kid wear his Marine Corps sash. Mother says she is upset after her son's school district said she can't wear a Marine Corps sash to graduation. Don Englert says she is proud of her son's decision to join the Marines and thinks he, he should be allowed to show his commitment during graduation. However, the district says graduation is a time to recognize what school students have already accomplished at Hilton High School, not a time to recognize what they plan to accomplish after graduation. That means students joining the military cannot wear military sashes. That is bullshit. Translation to this is Hilton High School is a rat, another rat's nest of liberals running things. As a mom, it's hard enough to send my boys to fight a battle that I can't fight for them, says Don Angler. But more importantly, I want him to know that as a country, as individuals in Hilton, New York, that we're proud. Seems reasonable to me. Uh, you liberals there at, uh, who run that school, this is military that's supposed to be protecting you. Sorry, the site uh, did something goofy there. Now, there's a petition here at WHEC. You want to sign it? A uh, link on the uh, Facebook, YouTube video. Don tells us this is not the first time schools denied students the right to wear military sashes, and she hopes. And in the future, the policy will change. I'm just so proud and don't want this to discourage his journey because this is his journey that he chooses and he chose it for us, she says. Sounds like quite a kid. Despite the principal's response, Donna is still fighting. She has startled a petition online that now has more than 50 signatures. It just got mine, by the way. We did reach out to several surrounding school districts to see if they had similar policies. We found West Rondecoy does allow military sashes and pins to be worn at graduation, but several other schools like Brackport still do not, so Hilton is not alone. Like you said, uh, many of them also are rats nests of anti-patriotic liberals. Some patri some liberals are patriotic. Uh, some are not. Well, uh, this person, Michael J. Hughes, uh, says maybe all he spelled it wrong. Maybe all his family members can attending can wear the sash for him. Congratulations, good luck, God bless. That's an interesting idea. Well, I guess let's expand this a little bit. Trying to get every guest at the graduation to wear the Marine Corps sash. Or better yet. How about a liberalism is a mental disorder uh, t-shirt? That would be a pretty good one. Because liberalism is a mental disorder. I'm Artifacts Mars. Thanks for watching.